Hey guys, RC here, back with episode 24. We are playing Football Manager 19. This is our hometown heroes save with Infield Town Football Club, a fan-owned club, which is what got my attention if you don't remember. Uh, so we had started the season 3-0. We played about we played five games since then, so take a quick look. We extended our win streak with an eight three dismantling of Tunbridge. Tom Hanley scored in the second minute. Uh, new striker Jermaine Osai got a hat trick in the first 33 minutes of the match. Arl Amu with a brace in the first half. Ryan McLean with another goal all in the first half. And then an own goal from Jonathan Henley. Uh, not much defense in this one and a uh, big win for us. Then we uh, had a 1-1 draw with Worthing. Osai scored again. Tom Hanley was sent off with a straight red card. Uh, he ended up serving a three-match suspension for that for this game. Another 1-1 draw against East Thurrock. Osai with another goal. He has been on fire for us. Uh, against Leiston. Leston. I'm thinking that's Leston because it's Lester. LEI, I'm guessing it's Leston. That's what I'm going to go with. Uh, three to one win. Brandon Adams with a hat trick. Ryan McLean scored off the back line. And then a 2 2 draw against Herringay. Osai with another goal. Uh, right back, Timmy Awika with a goal. And we gave up a 79th minute equalizer. So at this point, we are still unbeaten on the season. Third in the table with 18 points, just one off the lead. Uh, one of only two clubs without a defeat, knock on wood. Three draws, of course, and plus 13 goal differential. So we're playing well, uh, much better than we were anticipated. But three draws, <coughs> excuse me, in our last five. So coming into today, we are playing... Barking to end the month of August, and then we'll follow that up with Needham Town to kickstart September. Uh, we've won both matches against Barking. We're favorites on the road. So if we, get, I'm going to go. I'm, I've been playing our 4-4-2 with uh, the two Volantes rather than the anchors. I did play the anchor in one of the draws, but I've been playing the, the straight uh, Volantes for the most part. And let's see, so Osai. Let's take a quick look at him, just because I want to. <laughs> All right, so he has 10 goals in eight matches in the league. So he is off to a really hot start. Adams, that's not what I want. I want to click on the name. There we go. Help me out here. Adams has uh, three in seven. So his scoring almost one in two, but Osai has really been the dominant player for us. Sarpong, back from injury. White has been playing well in goal. So let's get to it. Hopefully we can keep our form. I do not think an Invincibles run is, is in the works here, but, hey, you know, that would be great to hope for. Uh, you know what? I'm going to go with it, and, wow, okay. Well, there you go. So he says don't say anything and then tells him to go out and put on a display. Fair enough. All right, we are in the yellow. God, I don't like <laughs> I know I've said it every season, but I really don't like those kits. Come on, boys. Any of you guys have uh, any cure-alls for uh, insomnia? Let me know. 
in the comments because I'm certainly interested. <laughs> All right, there's a kick from the back. Adams plays it up, drops it into Osai. He does a one-touch. His 11th goal of the season, Adams with the assist. I thought Adams was going to take it deeper in the box, but he, he made that nice little layoff pass, and Osai was able to drive it into the box. I think he did a really good job taking that extra touch to cut it inside a little bit. Oh, look at that touch by Osai. Oh, he had, he had a clear shot with Walker. Got a little greedy there, looking for an early brace. Oh, no. Kyle King, sixth goal of the season, set piece. Slides it between White and the bar and the post. The post! Uh, that's been our weakness all season, is set pieces. But it looks like that might be something with the game because I've noticed uh, oh, over the top, Osai drives it in. Thomas just gets a finger on it to knock it aside. Uh, I noticed Loki Doki also has a lot of set piece issues in his saves. So, oh, keeper couldn't get his hands on it. We had a shot, bounced off a defender. All right, Adam Ramadan has been booked. Come on, boys. Yellow card to Carl Bick. Come on, boys. Slight possession advantage, two to one on shots. Three clear cut chances for us. We should definitely have more to show. Oh, there's a nice tackle. Sarpong up to Adams. Adams to Sarpong. Oh, he's taken down. A oh, tackle right into Osai. Oh, a little ping pong action there. Knocked right back to his feet by the keeper, and he puts it into basically an empty netter. Second goal of the game, 2-1. to one. By Tiki gets booked. All right, Akinola, Adams, plays it outside to Sarpong, by Tiki. Oh, nice try, nice try, working the ball in, that looked good. Awika, Walker, plays it in, Adams gets past the back line. They're hitting it right into the keeper, though. Come on, fellas. Is Ramadan gone? Oh. Come on, Adam. Oh. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Um, all right, we're going to drop him back to support. All right, and I do want to drop, and yeah, we'll set that up here in a minute. Oh, uh, that's trouble, that's trouble. All right, avoid a booking. I cannot talk to Ramadan. Very disappointed there, son. Very disappointed. All right, and I do want to go to balanced. All right, uh, 
concentrate. Jackson hoofs it up top, headed out by the defense. Another good defensive play to clear it. They're starting to control the midfield though. McLean building from the back. Asiana by Tiki. Sarpong. Oh, some squares there. A through ball. Osai. Good touch. Oh, he tried to lob the keeper, it looked like. <laughs> All right, come on. Awika. Body. Playing out of position, but... All right, Sarpong. Good ball over the top. Adams. Adams. Two times. Yeah. Good God. Offsides. Handball. Crap. That was a great scoring opportunity. All right. Body. This is the connection. Asiana. Don't play with the ball back there, fellas. What the shit was that for? <laughs> Come on. All right, Ryan McLean. All right, I need to look at a sub here. Uh, defensive center. Let's bring in uh, Osini. And defensive left. Let's bring in Charlton. Get our yellow cards off. All right, Akinola makes the run, corrals the ball. By Tiki, picks out Osai. Nice ball, turned aside by Thomas. Come on, boys. All right, there's our, our subs. So we're done. I mean, that's all three subs for us. All right, nothing happening. Tell them to tighten up again. Oh, no. That was a, uh, man, set pieces that close. Ah, Charlton. And there it is. We hold on for the victory. That could be a big win. So, you know, wins like that where we're a man down for a whole half and then still hold on. Well, strangely enough, we just had a power surge. Nothing went out. Everything stayed on. But let me uh, leave to the assistant. Continue. And let me save this real quick. <laughs> All right. We'll be back for the next match in a second. We're back for the Needham Market game. So that was kind of odd. Usually when I have a power surge or a power outage, uh, power flash like that, you know, my computer restarts and... You know, but nothing went out. So that was, uh, that was interesting. We're favorites. We are at home. Um, Ramadan is suspended. Hopefully it's only for the one match. Let's see. All right, Charlton body gums is back. That's good. Let's 
So pretty good run of form, I would say, for Infield Town. A little bit of rain. I am thinking about trying to get one of those um, those kneeling chairs, I think is what they call them, basically to help your posture and, uh, you know, so giving it some thought. Oh, there's some good ball movement there. Ooh, a slide from behind. Lucky. Walker with some space. Plays it up to Adams. He's tackled by Tavernier. Uh, Adams with the steal. You know, if you're going to make a play like that, put it into the net. <laughs> Put it into the net. All right, Platt comes out and makes the stop there. So I hope everybody, if you celebrate Christmas or Hanukkah or whatever, I hope you had a good one. Uh, I am recording this on the 22nd, but it will be uh, going up, I think, on the 29th is what I'm thinking. Adams? Blasts it in. Fourth of the season. Nice attack. one nothing. So, yeah, I hope you guys had a, had a good holiday. Uh, if you took time off, if you had some vacation time, I hope you, like I did, I hope you enjoyed that. Sad news is, by the time this comes out, my vacation will almost be over. I'll have a few days left. <coughs> I'm off through New Year's. And I go back on, I believe, now, I, now I'm not sure. I go back on the 2nd of January. Walker drives it in, lobs a shot wide. Seven shots to zero. Possession heavily in our favor. Um... Demand more. Oh, there's a big clearance. By Tiki makes the run, hauls it in. Uh oh. Uh oh. It's a foot race, and Shakespeare shows some speed. Oof. Off the crossbar. That was. <laughs> that was scary. All right, one nothing. Come on, boys. That Shakespeare guy. I also, I can't, I can't get my camera directly figured out. So you'll notice I'm a little bit bigger here. I'm in the same size frame, but I'm bigger. And no, I didn't gain weight or, or grow. But uh, I, I zoomed the camera in because I was tired of losing the corners here. And, uh, yeah, so that's, uh, that's what that is. So I'm still playing around with that a little bit. Yeah, I don't need the, I know I don't need the headphones. Hey, Fred, how are you? Uh, let's see. I think I'm going to pull Walker off. Can I send, if I send McLean in up top, Let's bring Gums in at the center. And let's rest Osai. Let's bring in Arel Amu. Let's go with that. So anyway, like I said, I'm still trying to play with the frame and the hat. I just can't... Uh, can't get it. I tried to dial it in today, but it uh, it wasn't cooperating. So, and in or out doesn't really help any. Uh, Tavernier should be sent off with a second yellow. Stay out of my bowl, cat. Stay out. Got. Stay out of my bowl, cat. <laughs> Holy cow. 
You just made me miss about five minutes. I don't even know what happened. <laughs> All right. They play it back. Asiana plays it off. McLean plays it over the top to Amu on a yellow. Crossed. Adams, one touch. There's the clincher. Brandon with his fifth goal of the season. By the way, if any of uh, Infield Town fans are watching these videos, which I hope you are, um, that's one of the goals of, of doing a smaller team is because, you know, it's something you want to do. But also, smaller teams are more likely to participate. Uh, you know, kind of like with Ryan getting involved on Twitter a little bit, which is nice. Um, big win for us, two nothing. Uh, but if there are any players uh, from the from Infield Town that have left or I've let go or whatever that you want to check on every once in a while, just let me know in the comments. I'll be happy to pull them up and uh, let you take a look at them. Uh, let's see. I am going to pleased with the performance. Get out of my bowl, cat. You are hard-headed. Gee whiz. All right, so the run continues. I will call this a successful episode with two wins, keeping us up in second position. We're going to be playing, uh, starting the FA Cup in the next round or the next match. Oh, actually, we just went top of the table. <sighs> Yes, that's great news. Adams is stellar, superb, and 10 matches in a row unbeaten. Of course, last year, remember, we, we had a long... Oh, excuse me, sorry about that. Uh, a long run near or at the top of the table only to fall apart at the end of the season. I certainly hope we can keep the form and then, um, you know, get some space. All right, so we are top of the league, and we start the FA Cup next match. Not going to come back for that, I don't think think let's see they do expect us to reach the second qualifying round so i don't know this may be the only one fa cup fa trophy what's the difference oh fa trophy is here all right so yeah i don't know the fa cup that might be <sighs> nah i'm not going to come back for it Hopefully we can advance and make a little bit of money. We are starting to bleed financially. Uh, we have lost, uh, well, we have, we've actually made income this month, but you can see we're over 52000 in the red. So we are starting to bleed money. We're still within payroll. I can't afford to bring anybody else in. I would like to get rid of a couple of players, I suppose I could adjust my budget, get some transfer budget. We could get about $3,000 and then see if that allows me to buy some players out. Um, the other thing I could do is go in and find the guys that are not playing. any and see if if I can redo their contracts see he needs to be playing more two goals in five matches four off the bench he probably needs to be my primary bench guy Gilby, Gilby's another one. They've both actually improved a good bit.
Now he's valued at 3.3. Uh, he is under contract through this year. I wouldn't mind maybe selling him. The problem I, I see is when you're playing lower league, you want to be a seller. You have to be able to sell players to offset your financial losses. And it's, it's these guys, you know, that I need to be able to sell. Like, Osai is under contract. No, he's not under contract. He's on a free. So, boy, I certainly wouldn't want anybody coming and taking him for nothing. Um, I see Ramadan, if we could sell him for 3500 bucks, you know, that would be a win for us. We picked him up on a free. But the problem is, at our level, as a 7th or 8th tier team, the teams that he would actually be able to play for, maybe one or two levels above us, usually don't have the budget to buy. So, you know, it's a catch-22. Anyway, enough rambling. Leave a like, subscribe if you're new to the channel, and we will see you next time, guys, and the run continues. How far can it go? We'll find out. Take care. Bye.